Welcome back everyone to another Khan Academy tutorial on points, lines, and planes. Today we're going to be learning about what the difference between these three concepts are and how to differentiate between the three of them uh, within the three dimensions, one dimension, two dimensions, three dimensions. So are the points U, H, and L collinear? Let's break this word down, collinear. Co means together and linear just means line. So together on the same line. So we're just going to look here at points U, L, and H, or U, H, and L. Are they on the same line? Yes, they are. They are on line L. So we are going to say yes, they are on the same line. That means they are collinear. One down, six to go. What is another way to name line L? Okay, there's a very important uh, naming nomenclature that means way of doing uh, way of naming things here um, you can call uh, a line L by using a lowercase letter so line L we use lowercase if it's just one letter you use lowercase we can't use an uppercase like this okay that's that's bad you can't do that so a is out you can't use an uppercase and call that L the thing I do like about whoops, the thing I do like about option A is it has a line, um, meaning an arrow in both directions on the top of it. Okay. The second thing, the number B option or <laughs> letter B option, three letters. Three letters are also bad. You never use three letters when naming a line, so that option is out. If it has a line like this on top, that means it's a line segment with a definite start and stop like this which is not the case above. If you take a look here, you can see that it has arrows in both directions. So that is also incorrect. Uh, just add on to this. There we go. M-O and then M-L. These are both two letters and they have arrows in both directions. So they're both indicating a line, which is good, not a line segment. We don't want a line segment anyway, but now we need to make sure the letters are correct. So we have ML and MO. MO goes like this, which is not line L. Line L is this guy, whereas ML is exactly on the same line. So it's collinear with line L. It's the same line, so we can call it ml like that let's check it we're good to go next up we have are the lines l and e collinear now you're going to look at this and you say no way it's not on the same line look there's a line here and l is on it but e is not that is a trick and the reason why it's a trick is any two points can be connected with a straight line so any two points are collinear this is a trick question so we're going to say yes and the reason why is because you can draw a, a line a straight line through any two points if you have a point here and a point here it may not be on this line but you can always draw a line between those two points so even though there's some lines drawn already you can always draw a new line to make them collinear meaning they can be on the same line it's when you have three dots that it's a little bit three points that it's a little bit more tricky so we're going to say yes Ha! we bypassed that trick are the points g c a and y coplanar now we're talking about being on the same plane we're not talking about two dimensions or sorry we're not talking about one dimension we're talking about two dimensions up down left right so this is our up down left right plane a plane is a two-dimensional surface and we want to know if gc and y are all on this surface and it looks like they are we have g c a and y all on this plane the only one that looks like it's drawn outside of the plane is i so we're going to say yes it is okay are the points W, U, and N collinear? Okay, remember I said when you have three points, that's when it gets a little bit more tri tricky. So we have W, U, and N. Are they collinear? Co so it looks like W and U, definitely, they're on the same line. If we had W and N by itself, definitely on the same, same line. And then N and U by itself, yes. But all three of them? No, you can't draw a straight line that connects all three of these points together. So therefore, 
It is not collinear. We're going to put no. N-O means no. Next question. What is another way to name line L? Line L, okay, we already said we can't use three letters. This option, let me scroll down. We already said, uh, let me, so it's a line A, V, and M, all on it, okay. So we can't use that. We can't use three letters. It's a line. It's not a line segment, so we can rule out this guy. This means it's a line segment with two dots where it ends distinctly. We can't use one big capital letter like that with uh, arrows on top, even though it is a line and you do want an arrow in both directions. You don't want to do that. And I don't think it goes to the point J, so we're going to rule out that one. So it's D, A, M. Yep, it goes through A, M, arrow in both directions. There we go. Last question. Are F and M collinear? We already said this. Any two points are collinear. We even have them drawn on the same line here, F and M. So they are collinear. Yes, they are. Check the answer. And you're going to hear this sound. That means you've done a great job. And I will see you next time on West Explains Best. Take care.